Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, if you have not subscribed, please subscribe and give you this video a thumbs up. Um, today, mm, I know that I'm not going to be getting the Jeffree Star, so <clears throat> the five year anniversary mystery boxes, which I'm okay with it, whatever. But, I did go out to Ulta and got a couple things. Um, the first thing I got, and I went ahead and wet it down, is the Morphe sponge. Um, this was $80. Or $80, oh my god, $8. $80, what the hell is wrong with me? <laughs> and then I got this, um, which I have... Tarte eyeshadow palette. So, I have never tried the foundation, and this is the face tape foundation. This was, I believe, thirty nine. I don't know what I did with the receipt, but oh well. This was twelve dollars. This is Morphe's Bake and Set. And the reason I got the foundation at Ulta and went up there and got it at Ulta because I wanted to make sure I got the correct one. And this is a fair neutral 12 in, so it's more to my skin tone, I guess. We tried three different things, me and one of the ladies that worked there, so that was the closest one. And then I got the Tarte Shape Tape uh, Concealer. This is 27, I think it was. And this is 12 in fair neutral. Um, usually I tend to go light, uh, shade lighter, but I, for some reason, just went ahead with that one. And then I seen this, and I thought it was cute. The packaging is really pretty. Um, this is Frida Kahl's. Don't quote me on it. It's uh, by Ulta Beauty. And it is sepia is the color, which I thought that was a pretty color. So we're going to give it a shot. And so I'm going to do my mascara. Mascara, oh my god. <laughs> I'm going to do my foundation and my contour. I don't know why. No, I cannot speak tonight. But I gotta go back to work tonight and I gotta be there at 9 30. And so we're just gonna jump into this because I need to do one more video because I also want to do an eyeshadow look. So I want to do like just how I do my contour and everything and then I'll do a, another video of doing a eyeshadow look. Because I don't want to be this video too long. Because I am doing it on my phone. I'm not doing it on a like like a video camera or anything. So we're gonna jump into it. All right. Probably, oops. <laughs> Probably should have had a lot of this stuff ready to go. But hey, it's all right. So how many of you got the Jeffree Star? Um, mystery boxes. Are you excited for them? I've seen some things that do come in it. So, you know, I thought that was pretty cool. Yeah, I didn't get it, but I mean, I kind of figured once they sold out, they were out. I mean, I still haven't got the email, but I already know. I mean, it's just, I mean, I'm just, it's wishful thinking that it's not happening. So, I mean, I can always wait for the next one. Um, I did see some highlighters in there that were going to be in there. Um, I don't know if I was too, if I was excited for that or not. I don't, I don't know. Like, it just didn't look like my thing, but some people are different than me. I do like Jeffree Star because he makes me want to go out of my comfort zone and try something venturous. You know what I mean? Like, I'm more of a nudes girl. I'm going to be using... Glow Ahead Illuminating Face Oil for by Wonder Beauty for my um, primer. Okay. 
I didn't put enough on my hands. So I'm gonna go back into it. And it's so sticky, that's why I use it. Because it's something your foundation can stick to. Are y'all having a great day? Um, mine was kind of cold and wet. Like, like it was raining, so I just stayed home. I didn't go anywhere. <laughs> Stayed home and spent time with the kids and just hung out. I feel like I didn't get enough down here. All right, I think that'll be good. All right, I'm ready to dip into this foundation and try it out. I've never tried this, so it's... I'm hoping it's good. It's supposed to be like um, full coverage, flawless natural, matte finish, and infinite likes. I like the packaging though. It is cute. It's kind of blurry. So I do think it's pretty. My mom will love it because she loves purple. Alright, I always put it on my hand, um, and then, nope, <laughs> that's why, oh my god, <laughs> I forgot, a little bit was far away, because I did try it out the storm, I had to blend this around on my neck, oh my god, I put, I put too much on, <laughs> Hi, how are you? <laughs> oh, God. This is weird. I can't, I forgot. A little goes far away. Tip. Less is better. <laughs> oh, my God. And it's like, it's just like, <sighs> I feel like I'm a ghost. I don't think this is my shade. There's no way that's my shade. Maybe it was darker in the store. I don't know. Maybe I put too much on. That's crazy. I might have to go back and get a different shade. I just don't feel like that's my shade. I feel like I'm a ghost. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I feel like I'm a ghost. Like when she did like a section it when she blended it really well it looked like it but i just feel like it's not <laughs> i feel like i'm a ghost <laughs> i'm sorry <laughs> but that is hilarious no oh, god We're definitely gonna have to use them. Like, I don't know. I feel like that's two different colors. Look. That does not match the rest of my body. I look like one of them ghosts, man. I swear. I feel like this is it. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna have to tan this up. Um, maybe, <laughs> I 
I don't know if it was just like the lighting or what, but it looked like it at first. But this, I feel is too white. It just looks too white, in my opinion. Yeah, I'm definitely have to go back up there because I feel like that is too white. If I'm looking at my face and looking at my arm, my arm looks so much tanner than my face. Like it's like two two different colors. I mean, I could see a difference. I don't know if you can, but I can. <sighs> I think that just ruined it for me. And so I still got some on my arm, on my hand. I am putting that back in the bottle. I thought I looked more sand like, so that's why I grabbed the sand. I should have stuck with that. That was 125. I should have stuck with that one because I feel like that one's more my skin tone. This seems whiter. Like it don't even match my my skin. Look at that. Oh my god, I look such like a ghost. Okay. Okay. I'm sorry, guys. I can't help it. Like, look at that. See the difference? Look. <laughs> ah. Sorry, this is eating at me. This is eating at me, but we're going to keep going. <laughs> I'm going to take that back up. There's no way in hell. I look like a... I look so pale. Is this even, what is this? Oh, it says 12 in neutral. There is no way in hell. That, I, there's no way. Look at that. I'm so white. <laughs> I look like a ghost. Okay, let's do it. Okay, so this would be perfect. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, so this would be perfect shade um, <laughs> for my <laughs> concealer. I'm sorry, guys. Oh, I feel like I look like a ghost. I don't know if that girl needs some glasses or what, but I just, there's no way in hell this is my shade. I look so white. I'm looking at my arm, and then I'm looking at my face, and it's like my arm's... A little tan and my face is like boom why <laughs> I'm sorry guys I'm so sorry okay okay let's get into oh. <laughs> okay let's get into I'm sorry <laughs> I can't help it every time I look in the mirror I just oh, I want to laugh so bad because I look like a ghost Okay, let's let's do this. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay, I'm afraid to put too much on. <laughs> okay, that's enough. But we're not gonna do too much. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> sorry. I'm so sorry. Okay, let's get this. Oh my god. You know, I was thinking about baking, but I don't know if I want to do that now. Oh, that looks... Oh my goodness. And it's supposed to be full cabbage, but I could still see a freckle right there right there if you could see it one there and one there so I don't think it's full coverage in my opinion I have not met a foundation yet um, to completely cover that up so oh my god man I feel like like super white Mm -mm. That is nuts. Oh, guys, I don't know if I could wear this to work. 
I feel like right now, I feel like a ghost. Like, I seriously do. Like, can you see the difference? Yeah. I'm going to have to go back up there because this that's not my shade. That is not my shade at all. <sighs> that is nuts. I can't believe she thought that was my shade. I should just stuck with sand because I felt like that was more my shade. Because it actually blended well into my hand. But she said you want to put them on your face and that way you know what shade you are. But that's not my shade. Mm -mm. Okay, so we're going to apply some. We're going to try to bake this. Oh, God, I'm kind of nervous. Maybe I should went, like, with a darker baking powder. <laughs> if I knew I was going to be this white. <laughs> and basically, baking is going to lock in, like, it's going to heat it up and lock it in where it stays put all day. Or should. Wow. Okay, we're going to give that a shot. I just feel like that's... I just feel like that's too much. Like, I just... I am like super pale in the face and I just feel like man I look like a ghost but let's move it on we're going to cover fix that I got from Boxy Chime and we are going to do our contour I'm gonna have to darken this at I'm definitely gonna go up there and I'm probably gonna get that sand one because I should have went with that from the get-go like I felt like that would have been more my color so I don't know I just feel like that's not my color cute though. I do under my jawline just to give me more um like really underneath to give me more I think more of a depth jaw. And then a little on the nose. And then we're just going to blend that in really well. Now that I'm like done laughing. Yeah. Sorry, I'm trying to get comfortable. Alright. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, so... Have you ever went to Ulta and went up there for a foundation that clearly isn't your skin tone and did they, you know, like tell you the wrong one? Did you get the wrong one? Because apparently I got the wrong one. So I'm going to have to use some bronzer to try to bronze in that up and then I don't know I mean I can I might have to check and see if I can't take that back because that is clearly not my skin tone um I, there's just no way in hell like 
when your face is whiter than the rest of your body, that's, come on guys. <laughs> you know what I mean? My hair's getting in the way. And basically when I do my contour, I go by underneath my cheekbone and I go down um, about mid right here. And then I, I go up with it and put it, it back in like to my hairline. That's what I do. And try to blend it really well. Down here underneath my jawbone, I go under. I go down. I don't go up with it. Um, and you want to let this bake for about 15 minutes. And then we're going to go back up. on my hair. I go up into the hairline. That way, I don't know, like it gets close to my hairline so you can't see that, I don't know, I guess that I'm a different color. <sighs> and then we're going to blend this one down. I'm going to go up with this one. It's always like harder to blend that way. And I'm already wiping some of that stuff away. Okay, now we need to get the nose. Some people use, like, other brushes for it. I just go ahead and use the same brush. And if I need to touch up on something, I will. Alright, now I got that. Now I'm going to take my Moda brush. Um, I don't remember what the number is on this. They didn't put the numbers on these. This is one of the studio brushes I got from Boxy Chime. And I'm just going to go ahead and, I don't know, maybe I'll do my, eyeliner, my eyebrows and then wipe that off. That's what we'll do. Um, I got Brow This Way by Ramel London. It's kind of hard to see it because it is fading away. You can tell I use it a lot. I don't even really use the cream. I just use the powder. So. Brush my eyebrow hair up. And I like to brush that down. And then I just shape them the way I want them. Oh, or my eyebrows are not identical and you could tell this is just the way they are I was told once by a chick when I was getting my eyebrows waxed that eyebrows are meant to be fraternal twins <laughs> they're not supposed to be identical and I laughed at it I thought it was funny I've never heard of that anyone saying that but I went with it And we already got one done. I 
I just do something simple. I don't really go all into to it. Um, just because I'm just a simple person. And then I like to try to blend it out a little right there. Mm. Sorry, guys. For some reason, it is not taking right there. My eyebrows are being suffering. That's good. Sorry. <laughs> Humming. Hmm. Why is that one looking different? And now we're trying to get it to look right, and for some reason it doesn't want to. Maybe it's not even that one, maybe it's just this one. Well, it'll be all right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, I'm going to wipe it this way. I've already made this video too long, so we're going to get off here, and I'm going to make a different video. Alright, and to darken this up, I will be using um, where to go? Be using this elf Painter, so I will get back with you on this.